Delta State Government at the weekend expressed its condolence message to the Benanawe of Ogulaha Kingdom, Torobo I, and the entire Timiya's royal family. The state deputy governor, Dikin Kingsley Otwaru, who led top government officials to the palace annex of the Ogulaha Paramount ruler, said that the news of the passing of the Timiya's matriarch came to the Delta State Government as a shock. Dickie Notoire, while delivering the Delta State Government's condolence message, said that parents are among one of the greatest assets given to children by God Almighty, adding that no matter the age they die, they are still going to be greatly missed. He noted that the Delta State Government have come to condole with him and the entire Timia's royal family. Dike Notuaru appealed to the bereaved Timia's royal family to take solace in the fact that their monarch lived a fulfilled life and she is in the bosom of her maker. Deeply led by His Excellency Senator Dr. Ifani Yankua as governor, in whose proxy I stand, brings you a heartfelt Condolences brings you a message of hope, a message of strength and comfort on the passing on of your beloved Monday to glory. There is nothing in saying the fact that parents are amongst the greatest assets to Other sympathizers that also paid condolence visit to the Benanawe of Ogulaha Kingdom are the family of the former paramount ruler of Ogulaha Kingdom, His Royal Majesty Gilbert A. Dosse, the Ogulaha Development Cluster Board, the Ijo Christian Association of Nigeria, and members of the Cherubim and Seraphim Church on the state. Time is weeping, and we come to console him. He said, No, let him relax and think of 
the way forward in life. He has a lot and so many people to take care of. Because if he remain mourning, the kingdom will, will, will collapse. So we pray and we ask him to pedal his mourning so that the kingdom can move on. Responding on behalf of the Gula Paramount ruler, Chief Prevoa Karaway thanks the Delta State Government and others for finding our time to commiserate with the Benanawe of Ogulaha Kingdom and the entire Timias Rio family. His Majesty, today here this morning, there are certain things that actually burden his mind. Uh, he has been expecting this visit for a very long time before now. His Excellency is his, the governor of the Delta State, is his personal friend. And the deputy governor is own. But today you have come, having the mandate of His Excellency the Governor, Senator Dr. Ifan Koa, to be here to console him. He said he's very much happy. He's not happy because he lost his mother for people to come and console him. But uh, one teacher, artist, he said, for anything that happened, that needed people to come and console you, and you have not seen the people forthcoming. He said, equally believe me, something is wrong in your process. Uh, your presence here, his mother said, you will no longer have a good thing. You also make the request and that uh, when the time comes, when the time comes to give her the final right of burial, let you be informed. His Majesty said it's going to do so. On the lens note was later signed by the Delta State Deputy Governor Dickin Kingsley Otwaro and other sympathizers as well as prayers were made for the Timias Rio family by the clergy groups.